and extract of the English translation as rendered by Father Charles J. Mullally, S.J., National Director of the League of the Sacred Heart. Having, in God's mysterious designs, become the successor of the Prince of the Apostles, those apostles whose doctrine and preaching were by divine command destined for all nations and for every creature, and being the first pope to make use of this truly wonderful invention of Marconi, we in the first place turn to all things and all men, and we say to them in the very words of sacred scripture, Hear, O ye heavens, the things I speak. Let the earth give ear to the words of my mouth. Hear these things, all ye nations. Turning now to men, we bear in mind the words of the apostles. Work good to all men, and especially to those who are of the household of the faith. We are pleased, therefore, to address in the first place those who have been received and live in the Lord's family and the Lord's fold of the Catholic Church, and call us by the loving name of Father, sacred pastors and faithful sheep and lambs, whom Christ, the universal pastor and king, has entrusted to us to nourish and to guide. You, our fellow laborers, in the various orders of the hierarchy, cardinals of the Holy Roman Church, patriarchs, archbishops, bishops, prelates, and priests, chief objects of our daily solicitude, as well as the sharers and helpers in our labor. We earnestly exhort each one to persevere in his vocation and to walk worthily in the vocation in which you are called. Feed the flock of God which is among you, being made a patron of the flock from the heart, so that when the Prince of Shepherds shall appear, you may receive a never-fading crown of glory. Meanwhile, may the God of peace, who brought again from the dead the great pastor of the sheep, our Lord Jesus Christ, in the blood of the everlasting testament, fit you in all goodness, that you may do his will, doing that which is well-pleasing in his sight through Jesus Christ. At this moment, the Holy Father gives the papal blessing in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. <laughs>